<laughs> Tis the season to say hey, hi, howdy, and hello, ho, 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 ho. <laughs> the Feast of the Winter Star is almost here, and that means Santa and crew have their work cut out for them. In the spirit of giving, I've recruited a bunch of Santa's helpers to help sort through all these gifts for the citizens of Stardew Valley, while helping me, the Candy Cane Witch, raise funds for a good cause. Toys for Tots is celebrating their 75th anniversary of providing gifts and cheer to the economically disadvantaged children during the holiday season. So this fun collab is fundraising for that cause. More information down below. Let's help bring some joy and smiles this year. Alrighty, I've hired five little elf helpers to help sort these gifts, and before they can assist Santa, I have to put them through some training and elf lessons. So, let's get to know them all just a little bit. Hi, I'm Brandigan, and some people know me because I've been around for a while. I won the Stardew Valley Cup with Boo, Simsy, and Fuzzerino. I do a lot of videos about game mechanics and slimes. Nothing recently, but I do love hopping in when other creators have fun ideas going. So I'm here and uh, Wickedy, thank you for inviting me. I really appreciate it. I, th I think I'm a general good in the world. So yeah, let's let's just say I was on the good list. Hello, um, I'm Lee. I go by a 20 something loser online. I am a Stardew Valley speedrunner, more or less, that focuses on marriage speedruns. <laughs> From Santa, I would really like a tea set. I, I'm hoping Santa could, you know, pull some strings here for me. My favorite holiday treat, ooh, I would have to just go with a classic hot chocolate, right? You can never go wrong throwing a couple of marshmallows on top. This is Charlie, Charlie Burley. Indeed, indeed. <laughs> and I love Christmas. <laughs> I really like snickerdoodles. They're so good. I love them so much. <laughs> Addicted. They're bad. <laughs> and they like get better when they sit, I feel. I would say I was fairly nice. I don't- I can't think of anything I did wrong, but I don't want to say I was perfect. Well, hello everyone. My name is Poxio. You probably know me best for my 100 days series so far. Um, and I'm very excited to be here. I'm just like an elf. It's super cute. I love Christmas. We have this thing in New Zealand. Now, Australians will claim it. It is called pavlova and it is delicious. It's like a fluffy dessert. It's kind of hard to describe, but like, oh, once you have it, it is just so good. <laughs> I'm gonna ask Santa for more subscribers. <laughs> Hello, thank you for having me. My name is Lee Chaton. I stream on Twitch. Most people just call me Lee Chat and I like starting. Um, I asked for a pile of pusheens and plants. Uh, my favorite holiday treat is sugar cookies. Uh, would you say that you were naughty or nice this year? That's a trick question, isn't it? <laughs> uh, I, I think I was nice. <laughs> I, I, I was a good girl this year. Okay, helpers, before we all have milk and cookies, it's time to learn the work. Santa has his list, but he hasn't checked it twice just yet. So I'm going to be giving you a gift sorting lesson at the workshop in preparation of the big day so that we can have everything ready to go. This is not going to be an easy lesson. Oh no, I gotta keep you on your jingly elf toes. We don't know who has been naughty, nice, or just kind of not much of anything this year. So our lessons will have you guessing and setting aside some options for the sugar plum fairies to give to Santa during his final list look over. You'll need to sort through Santa's sack and place an often overlooked loved gift, a completely neutral gift, and a most hated gift in these sorted packages. And then I will look things over and give you the correct answers. The villager you'll be gifting for will be revealed behind this curtain. We have a lot of rounds of people to sort through, so you'll have 60 seconds to sort per round. I'll also give you a quick reminder. This is an important part of your training before I wheel out the VCR TV and you watch the three hours of videos going over how we're a family, not a company, candy cane striping techniques, and how to wrangle a reindeer. Alright, sound good? Alright, let's get started! The first person on our list is Abigail. The, f the first wife. I actually, this is horrible because I don't like Abigail, so I don't know anything about her. 
Um, I I'm pretty sure there's two dishes that she loves. I think. Loved gift. She likes. She loves amethyst, but I'm not seeing an amethyst in here. Uh... Oh no. Okay. Um. Okay. This one's a stumper for me. I'm not gonna lie to you. Let's go with that. Oh uh, no 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 no. But she loves adventuring. Oh, oh. Okay. 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 This isn't fair. I'm not looking at you know neutral or dislike gifts, right? I'm going for the gold. There we go. Oh, th that is a thing that she likes. I think fruits are... Please don't eat that. And then I chose that because it looked menacing. Answer time. Abigail hates dragon teeth, is neutral towards purple mushrooms, and absolutely loves blackberry cobbler. Okay, I, okay. that's the only one I felt good about. <laughs> if anything, I, I know what she would hate, I guess. That, that's on brand. Next up's one of my personal favorites, Emily. Ooh, Emily. Clint's watching carefully. <laughs> yeah, don't, <laughs> don't tell him. Gems. Emily loves gems, and that's simply all I know about her. Um, okay. You know what? I don't care. I'm going with that gem. Okay, I know she's a big, she's a big stone person, right? Rock rejuvenation. I'm thinking that quest. Jade stone. Let's do it. What's she about meh about? Maybe a tropical curry? That meh on a tropical curry, maybe? Maybe she's neutral about pickles. Pickles are, like, fine, you know? What is she like? No. I don't want that in my house. Definitely pickles. Boom, boom, boom. And then fish, because indeed, she is a vegetarian. I actually grabbed that before I said that, so I was like, something tells me that it would be this, so... Emily loves Jade. Yes. Uh, I didn't even see the jade in there. She's like meh with coconut. Crying inside, okay. And pretty much hates all fish dishes. Like the salmon dinner. Fish dish, big no for Emily. No fish dish off my watch. Well, that's interesting. You learn something new every day, yeah? Can you guess the gifts for Sandy? Okay, Sandy's a big flower person. Oh, you've put so many flowers in here. How am I going to pick one? Sandy! The one I probably know the least about. Oh, yeesh. Um, sunflower? No. Poppy? Could be. Fairy rose? Oh, that is cheeky. What would I give her? I used to just give her a bunch of sweet peas, but I don't. Obviously, that's not here. The tea set's in there. Now that's interesting. I feel like she's a classy kind of woman. Uh, no, but then she'd like caviar. I'm gonna say, uh, dislikes coal. What is she gonna hate, though, is the question. Maybe she hates the sandfish, because it seems too similar to her name. Let's give her a flower. Um, and then I feel like she might be neutral, okay? No, don't eat the sandfish. There we go. Say mound vegetable. Certainly not confident with these. Let's look at Sandy's list. Mango sticky rice for the love. Oh. I was considering that one. That was the backup one. Neutral to most for it, like the snow yam. And the only flower she hates, the poppy. Next on the list is sweet, sweet Caroline. Oh no, because I don't, I don't know. I don't know non-dateable NPCs is the problem. Oh, but wait, are these, okay, so are these gifts that they would like in real life, or are they actually the loved gifts from the wiki? In that case, that's going to be a dislike. <laughs> oh, goodness. Um, okay. I believe she, like, she loves that. I've never even looked at the dishes. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Um, the neutral item. Ooh. Okay, I don't know. We'll see what happens. <laughs> All right, here you go. <laughs> go with this. <laughs> That's not what I expected. Okay, cool. <laughs> I have no idea. All right, Caroline hates golden coconuts. Oh, is neutral towards duck feather. Ah. And loves tropical curry. Yay! Okay. Wow. 
I would have never have guessed that. I was looking at the curry, but the other two? Mm, nope. <laughs> Revealing the next person, it's Demetrius. Ooh, okay. Oof. And we're going. I feel like the dwarf gadget could be um, a trick because he's very sciencey. Okay, well, I'm Demetrius. I like. You know what? Screw it. You're getting a melon. Oh, does, does he like melons? Is that what it is? It's something like that. All right, you know, I feel like he wouldn't, he'd be the type that'd be like, you really give me a lump of coal in my stocking. <laughs> I'm gonna lock those in. All right, this is probably completely wrong. <laughs> Demetrius, no. Demetrius's list is rice pudding for loved, Nautilus shell for neutral, and unlike his daughter, he hates the radioactive bar. Interesting. <sighs> Man, I am rusty, rusty. Don't call it a comeback. This is that; those were warm-ups. Everybody's granny, Evelyn. All right, Evelyn. What are we working with? Oh, and you did give me a tulip. No. I think cookies are a debate because she sends cookies in the mail. I have like one item for like every character that I know is a fact. One of these. A leak would be interesting, but it's so George. She she likes flowers, but I don't know if that's a loved item. We'll go with it, sure. This is gonna sound bad. I feel like fruit salad is an old people thing. <laughs> is that wrong? That's probably wrong. Oh, is it? What would be? What would be new? She's. I'm gonna say that she hates coal. Let's go with that. The gifts for Evelyn are. <laughs> oh no! 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 From the box, she loves stuffing. Unlike her husband is neutral towards leek and hates pretty much everything with fish. Oh. Can you guess the gifts for Gus? All right, I know Gus is somewhat. I was confident at first and now I'm there. There's so many options that I just don't know. Okay, I pray that the love gift I give him is here and it's not. Love that for me. This is, this is Alex's, this is. You like to cook, my friend. And you like to cook fancy... Ooh, that's calling to me a little bit. Um, I'm gonna say that he is completely neutral to oil. He hates, like, coleslaw or something very oddly specific. And uh, there is coleslaw here. And he absolutely hates that. No. Uh... It's not cheese. It's not cheese. It's not cheese. It's not cheese. Maybe it's cheese. Maybe it's mayonnaise. Ooh, sure. And then coleslaw is hated, and I'm certain about that. Just gotta put them in the box. There we go. We'll go with this. What's on Gus's list? He's neutral towards pineapple, loves escargot, ah. and yes, he hates coleslaw. It was so random. What do you have against coleslaw? Like, coleslaw's fine. Up next, we have Alex. Oh, okay. I know he loves complete breakfast. Oh, what would Sam? What? Oh, what would Sam hate? I get. Oh, I always get them mixed up. Oh, I know. I I've got this in the in the bag. Absolutely. That is the loved. And then. He doesn't seem like a flower kind of guy. You know what I mean? Muscle remedy. Oh, I'm gonna put that as a maybe. As a okay. Okay. When I said <laughs> had it in the bag, I had one in the bag. I think. For hated, I think he hates. Oh no. Farmer's lunch. What's he a bit mad about? I don't know. Muscle remedy. I feel like he would like that. You know, I feel. This is stressful. We're gonna. Okay, I'm, I'm putting it down. I'm putting it down. It's, I don't know what what a hated gift would be. Those seem like they would be loved. Who the heck likes coal? Am I right? And then that is for certain correct. I I would die on that hill. Most love is complete breakfast. Congratulations. Yes, let's go. Strawberry for neutral. Oh, Alex. That's so funny. I thought strawberry. I saw it. I looked at it. And I was like, mm, maybe. And he hates muscle tonic. But he's like a, a muscle guy. That's so weird. Time to sort some things for Maru. Maru! It is Maru. Okay. Or we're gonna stay away from these. Diamond, iridium, you know, uh, 
battery. I strawberry. Though I I know she loves all of that stuff. What about a cooked dish? I actually think it is a cooked dish. I feel like she would hate vinegar. I don't know why, but I feel like she just would not be a fan of vinegar. Like she'd be like, "Mom, stop making me eggs or something." But like they're okay. I don't think it's a fish. I, I feel like I thought she loved rhubarb, but then maybe that's strawberry. But then so rhubarb pie. I don't know. That sounds good. Maru loves the rhubarb pie. Yay! Is neutral to almost every egg. Oh, so close. I'll take omelet as close. And hates truffles. Yes. yes. Truffles. Guys, we're learning. Hey, can I come back here? <laughs> ah, I'm next. Time to learn about the gifts for Haley. Oh boy, if I get this wrong, one of my viewers is probably going to kill me. <laughs> oh, I was looking straight for a dandelion, but it's not there. I mean, a sunflower. Haley would hate eggs. Animal products? I don't see Haley liking any of them. I feel like we're just gonna make this fun at this point. Okay. Okay. If I were Haley, what would I love, eh, and dislike? You've really thrown me off without a sunflower in there. I reckon Rainbow Shell, she's meh. I feel like this is something that Emily would just have around the house, that she'd be like, ugh, it exists, I'm okay with it, I'll just give it to my sister. Um, I'm just, I hate fish, there you go. And I know she loves these, I'm pretty sure. Oh, what else? Uh, let's go Summer Spangle. For gifts for Haley, she's neutral towards the Rainbow Shell. I'd say dumb luck. <laughs> She loves fruit salad. Oh, I knew that actually. I didn't see the fruit salad. Oh, I was looking at that too. Ah. Oh. And hates every single fish. Yay! I got one. <laughs> no fish dish in their households. No fish dish. Yeah, that's a fish free home in there. Time for everyone's favorite blacksmith, Clint. Goodness gracious. Um, okay. Clint. Okay. Beautiful. Where is a, uh, where's a gem? He loves most of the gems, but, uh, I normally give him, uh, topaz. So, I don't <laughs> know off the top of my head. Diamond. Pretty sure he loves a diamond. Ooh, well, that could be a throw. Dang it. No, I don't know. Neutral. Neutral. Um, let's go with that. I know Demetrius loves that, but that's, who knows about, uh, Clint. Let's get in the mind of Clint. What doesn't he like? He's a blacksmith. So, flowers. He hates flowers. No, don't eat it. <laughs> Uh-oh. Okay, there we go. Tiger's eye. Diamond. Flowers. I'm nervous about the diamonds at the beginning. Alright, Clint's gifts. He loves artichoke dip, is neutral towards refined quartz bars, and hates holly. Everybody's favorite Mayor Lewis. Golden statue, man. Let's go through... Ooh, let's see. Alrighty. Could tea leaves be relevant? I feel like that's the first time I've seen them. I thought he really likes those. Oh, it's one of these two. Oh, you gave me two that are very similar. It's either the super meal or the vegetable medley. It's one of the two. I'm going with the vegetable medley. <sighs> he loves hot peppers. Is there a hot pepper? There's pepper poppers. Oh, this probably is this cooked with parsnips. I think that he might be neutral towards. It's the universals versus the not universals out here. Ah, I may want to change this one. All right, let's go with it. Um, sure. I will be very sad if it is actually the super meal. Oddly enough, Lewis hates the treasure chest. Oh, that is weird. Neutral towards tea leaves. I should have gone with tea leaves. I was thinking he loves tea leaves. And yes, loves the vegetable medley. Oh, thank goodness. <laughs> Harvey loves the super meal. Let's get some gifts for the good Dr. Harvey. Ooh, Harvey. Okay, so obviously, like, coffee is not going to be a thing on here. Uh-oh. If there's anybody I know less than Abigail, it's going to be the Harvester. What about wine? That's juice. And there's no coffee here. That's and no wine. And no oh truffle oil? Nope. Matt's animation is not helping me today. Okay. Okay. 
I think I got one thing right. I actually think that... Oh, wait, but this dish looks the same as, like, this. Um, maybe he hates cheese. I don't know. Hated, hated, hated. People hate Holly. A lot of people hate Holly. But maybe that's why it's here, is to throw me off. This is a forgeable, and that seems right. And egg. Egg. A golden egg. Egg. Okay, I'm, I'm ready. I'm ready. <laughs> okay. <laughs> The egg was close. It wasn't the duck egg. It was the golden egg he's neutral towards. Oh my gosh. I was like, why is this here? It must be here for a reason. No way. Harvey hates the Nautilus shell. Yeah. Uh, and loves the super meal. Yeah, I told you it would be a comeback. It's just, it's a slow comeback. I'm starting to like see how you think. I'm like, the holly is a hated gift. So it's not going to be the holly. <laughs> Like, everybody hates that, so it can't be. Our local novelist, Elliot. Elliot! My sweet angel. Okay, so... This is a loved... I'm... Not actually, I don't know about that. You know what, we're gonna- we're gonna gamba here. We're gonna- we're gonna try this. Kind of a bougie guy, you know? He actually might hate this. I can't think. What's a what's a neutral? What is something that seems benign? Um, I'm gonna just grab this cheese. You know what? Just just to make things interesting, why not? Let's uh, I don't know. <laughs> Let's go with that. Would you like the good news or the bad news first? Uh, there's good news. <laughs> no, there isn't. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Elliot loves Tom Ka. Dang it, I was gonna put that too. I was looking at it. Oh. Hates Amaranth and is neutral towards truffle. I should have, I should have known. It's basically an egg, but from a pig. I can't believe myself. I, I know my man, Elliot. I do love Elliot. Gifts for fan favorite, Picky Pierre. 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 Does not like a lot of stuff. But one isn't in here. Oh no, wait, 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 wait. Hold up. I mean, this is a universal love. <laughs> Cause Pierre is hard. His lo his love gifts. Oh my goodness. I know this. I really do. I know this. <sighs> I wanna say for ideal. Um, I'm he well he hates parsnip soup. I know that for a fact, but you don't have that in here. It's either that or an, or the eggplant parmesan. I'm torn. Okay, we'll try that. I'm gonna say that he is probably neutral towards this, and then might be he might absolutely hate. Maybe, 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 maybe. This is an interesting choice. They're here to throw me off, though. You know what? He's just tired of seeing these in front of his shop, so he's gonna be like, ugh, another client that I have to fish out money while them selling these things, and then... Pierre loves the universal love, Golden Pumpkin. Ah, uh, Pumpkin? What? Is neutral towards the sweet gem berry. Yeah! And he hates corn. Oh, corn is absolutely delicious. Let's make these gifts magical, getting presents for the wizard. <gasps> Oh my goodness. Um, oh, I know probably the least, other than Sandy, I probably know the least about the wizard. Oh my god. Oh dear. I know he likes void eggs, but that's obviously not going to be there. Does he like any of these gems? Does he like a super cucumber? Or love it? Potentially? Interesting. Fairy dust is there. What would the wizard absolutely hate? Interesting. What's surprising here? I'm going to say obsidian. That's surprising. I like the purple vibes we got going on, so regardless, you know, why why do we have a dinosaur egg in here now? I think that's neutral. I'm gonna say he likes fairy dust. I'm gonna say Matt on fairy dust because he's a wizard. And what does he love? What does he love? Do we do we hate? I swear if he, you know, maybe no. I hope he doesn't hate cookies. That would be so sad. Hang on. We're gonna say that he hates cookies. <laughs> It's gonna make him so sad. <laughs> that was the panic click. Uh, I only gift him void. I don't know. Sure, uh, I'm gonna say Sasha. This is probably wrong, but 
That is nice. It's gonna look way better when there's three X's next to it. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, gifts for the wizard. We have neutral squid ink. He hates fairy dust, is actually universal hate, and loves the super cucumber. Good, okay. Let's check out Kent's list. Kent, year two. Oh no, no. Okay, um, right off the bat, I, I'm pretty sure hazelnuts are a thing he loves, and of course you don't have it here, do you? <laughs> Kent, okay, I think I know this one. It's either Fiddlehead Risotto or, oh yeah, there it is. Okay, um, what about maybe something that's cooked to like it? You, no, okay, let's go with that. Um, neutral. Or it was roasted hazelnuts. I know that one because he's only got like two. Yeah, he's very, it's very specific. I, I'm sure he likes cheese. Everyone likes cheese, right? <laughs> what about flowers? Are flowers a good idea? Yeah, there's the sunflower. Where was that for Haley? And let's go with... Ah, all right. What does he dislike? What does Kent hate? What does he go to sleep thinking about hating? Definitely jelly. <laughs> <laughs> wine? No, I feel like wine, everybody likes wine. Okay, wait, did you... Is that right? Um... Uh... There you go. <laughs> Yay! Yay! Okay. <laughs> That's right. Uh, Kent loves the fiddlehead fern risotto, is neutral towards magma caps and all mushrooms, and absolutely hates the algae soup. I don't give him algae soup. No, no, no. Let's get some gifts for Vincent. No! Okay, Vincent. Oh, boy. Something easy like cranberry candy is not going to be on here, is there? Oh, no snails. Oh, Periwinkle is speaking to me. I'm not getting a single one right for this kid. Is the miner's treat like a, a, a bait? I feel like maybe Jazz loves that. But I think, I think it's just because in my head it's like snail. Oh, wait, okay, that. What about snail? No... I got nothing for him. He hates clay, I think, but there's no clay here. I think, oh, there's a regular egg here, which makes me think it's not the egg as the neutral. Maybe it's milk, because I think I've tried to give that to him and he was not thrilled. Maybe that. Okay. It looks like a snail. I'm going with it. Um, egg meta because people don't like eggs and because it's cranberry sauce and not cranberry candy, he hates it. I don't know. That's, that's what I'm going with. I know that something is wrong. Periwinkle, maybe he hates that, honestly. Maybe it, yeah, 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 yeah. Vincent hates nearly every artisan good, like cloth, is neutral towards milk, and loves the ginger ale. Okay, yay! All right, the periwinkle as a replacement for snail did not pay off. <laughs> I, You know, like, I was just thinking like, okay, if I was a kid and I loved cranberry candy and then somebody gave me cranberry sauce, I'd be very offended. Next on the list is Penny. Penny. Okay, Penny, let's see what you got in your box. I know that the wine won't be here for her hated gift because that's too easy. Something probably super random. Well, no, that's what everybody would give her. Of course there's no emerald. I think she loves this though. Or is it this? I always get these mixed up because all the plates look the same. I don't know why I want to pick lemon stone. I have no idea why, but I feel like it's wrong. <laughs> I don't know. Ah, <laughs> uh, okay. What are you neutral about? Forageable things? I think you like fruits and also there's multiple, so it can't be that. Ah, uh, maybe. That's a forageable, I think. I'm gonna... I'm gonna take a chance on that, honestly. She hates all alcohol, so I'm going pina, col pina colada. Pin I'm a child. Okay. The coconut thing with the, the thing. Maybe oranges? I don't know. <laughs> I feel like she'd be like, or like, oh, you know what? No, we're gonna make this spicy if I'm gonna get it wrong. An apple, because you educate the children. Penny loves the roots platter. Oh, yeah. Is neutral towards the forged ginger and hates all alcohol like the pina colada. Penny, Penny, you and me. I'm I'm actually so proud of that. I logic that. I read Penny like the books she enjoys so much. Let's get some gifts for parrot boy Leo. Leo? Oh my goodness. Well, he does love mangoes. That's what we usually all give him. Oh, okay, okay, okay. 
I know a little bit of Leo. He loves an orange. I think he likes sticky rice too, actually. I think he gives you the recipe for that. Squid ink ravioli. If I were Leo, what would I be met on? I would say maybe... I don't know what I would say. But I have to say something. So let's say oh Crazen. Okay, maybe if I auto sort, it'll it'll shuffle them like words on stream, mixing letters, you know. I feel like he probably sees these all the time. He's like, ugh, ostrich egg. I don't know. And what does he hate? What does he absolutely hate? Say vegetables, maybe vegetables. Oh, this is difficult. Oh my goodness, you're you're getting you're getting pumpkin soup. Neutral or crazy hates veggies. Leo actually loves ostrich eggs. You're kidding. He loves the ostrich eggs. <laughs> <laughs> oh, don't do it to me. Oh, <laughs> oh, now that you say it, it is. Oh, ostrich eggs. Oh, I should have seen that. That's cheeky. It's oddly neutral towards coffee and hates oil. Why in the world would a child be drinking coffee? Leo, who gave you coffee? Don't go to the creepy guy on the other side of the island. Don't do it. Oh, wait, he's not there. The wife of the creepy guy. Yeah. It's time for gifts for Leah. Oh, okay. Interesting. Let's go, Leah. Salad? Wickedy, you've done me dirty once again. That's all I know on it. <laughs> Why does, like, the wood skip is standing out to me. I can't think of a single thing that she loves. Truffle oil? You are not making this easy. Leah's kind of one with the valley. I think she likes an autumn bounty. I have to pick a random dish, right? The loved ones. Let's go with that. Do I go fruit salad? Because that's kind of like a salad. Weird hated thing, maybe? Or coleslaw? I'm going to say fruit salad for the hate, because it's a weird hate for Leah. Wait, wait, wait. I got this. Um... Let's check out Leah's gifts. <laughs> yes! What? Yes! <laughs> I wish I had my face cam on right now. I'm jumping. Oh no. She loves stir fry, is neutral oh. towards wool, and hates pancakes. Oh, that's fair. Who hates pancakes? M maybe, maybe she's just like hardcore waffle girl, you know, like it, it, that's that's always the debate. It, are pancakes or waffles better? And I think pancakes are better. You know how I said that my next playthrough, I'm going to marry Mario. Maybe I have to go for Leah. We get each other. He buys seashells by the seashore. It's time for gifts for Willy. Ooh, Willy. Okay. Uh, he's an interesting one. I don't think I... Oh, boy. Willy! Um, alrighty. Willy. Ooh, okay. A lot of fish in here, but I know, like, he doesn't tend to like a lot of fish. He loves octopus. You're a jerk. You don't have octopus on here. Hmm. Hmm. I'm gonna put that as the hate. Uh, he does love diamonds. That's not on here. <laughs> okay, what about any of these fish? Um, okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Wizard loves super cucumber, which means that he loves sea cucumber, I think. Um, let's throw... There's so many, so many options here. And neutral, we're gonna have to go with... I think it's gonna be one of these fish dishes. Let's go with crispy bass. Um, okay. Uh, no, I feel like he probably likes those items. Um, we'll do this. See if I got the fish right, because I know he likes one of the fish on there. For Willy, he hates the sea urchin. What? I didn't know that. Likes most fish dishes, but is neutral towards dish of the sea. <gasps> oh no, wait. Oh, is it going to break my heart if you tell me that it's the dish of the sea? And the loved fish you were looking for was the sea cucumber. It's the other one. Okay, good. <laughs> good. Yeah, uh, Professor Wickedy, could I have a curve, please? <laughs> Let's get some gifts sorted for Pam. Pam! Alrighty. Miss Pam here. I know a bit about Pam. Will it be enough? Pam loves parsnips. We don't have parsnips. Your loved gifts. This is one of them. And there's no alcohol, so that must be the truth. Poor Pam also loves beer. She likes fruit. I know that because I give her fruit. I'm looking at the egg, and I, I don't think the egg is ever going to be the answer. She gives you battery packs, but does she love battery packs is the question. I don't think so. I think I'm going to go with the juice. I feel like she doesn't like fish, but there's no fish here. You know what? She might hate that. 
and then she might, might just might feel neutral towards. Um, no, she's probably okay with that. Maybe she hates juice because it was so close to being wine and it wasn't, so. We're gonna go with this as the neutral, because it's just a, just a vegetable here. Pam loves the glazed yams. Oh, okay. Neutral towards hops. Pamela, why? She's like, mm. it has potential, so I don't hate it, but I just don't like it. <laughs> this doesn't taste like alcohol. And hates the seafoam pudding. Seafoam pudding, interesting. I went with a storyline in my head instead of the logic that I set out. Let's pick out a few things for Sam. Sam, no cactus fruit in here, I bet. Ugh, I'm so good at knowing what's not gonna be here. Hmm. Or cactus fruit. No Joja Cola. Love that. Pizza? No. I feel like he'd be a type of burger and fries kind of guy. Yeah, I'll go with that. Maple bar. I... that? Maybe one. Nobody likes pine tar. No? Why, why would you want pine tar? Bah humbug, you know? What do you hate, my man? I think he's neutral about fruit, but there's three fruits. But I'm pretty certain, because I... Or maybe he likes fruit. Oh god, I don't know. <laughs> he doesn't like just plain cheese. We'll go with that. I know that. I think that's wrong. And I think that's wrong, but that's my answers. Yeah, pine tar and rival burger, sure. <laughs> no idea why, but Sam hates refined quartz bars. Oh. He actually likes tree fruit, but is neutral towards all other fruit. Uh, of course. And loves the maple bar. Ah, should have known that as a Canadian. What do you think is on Shane's list this year? Shane. Obvious choice is a hot pepper, but that's obviously not going to be in there. Of course not. Why would it? If I were Shane, what else would I like? Ah, uh, yes. Shane. Ha! This one I know. <laughs> this one I know, because we use it when we do the speedrun. Okay. Or, um, oh, he likes pizza. But that's not there either. <laughs> juice? No. That's not the Shane I know. I'm gonna say he hates juice. Just for the gag. The hate is gonna be the tough one, and the neutral too. It's because, you know, he has cows, so it's probably like something that exists, but he doesn't want to eat every day. And I'm gonna say the other thing he loves is maybe iridium? I don't know, I literally can't think of anything else for Shane. What else is there? What else is there? Let's have a quick look. Oh, I saw that at the last second and I was like, oh, actually, actually. Shane hates the universal hate energy tonic. He's neutral towards goat milk. And yes, he loves the pepper poppers. And now it is time for George. Ooh, George. Well, the, the loved is going to be easy. Oh, that's an easy one. Where's the leak? Oh, wickedy. Oh, <laughs> why'd you do this? Wait. Oh, you didn't put it in there. <laughs> um, okay. So, George, I feel like I know he likes old people stuff. And the hot pepper? Because it, no. Okay, hot pepper is a dislike because I heard a thing where he, he gets it to rub on his knee, but he actually hates it. It's got to be a recipe, right? Pearl is a universal... Oh, no, that's a universal, like... Oh, man. Uh... Let's go jelly. Uh, I don't know, cookie. Okay, okay, I can do this. Let's go with that. Wicked, I'm not going to lie to you. That was a terrible round from me. Oh, I don't like the apple at all. <laughs> George's loved gift is the pearl, which is also a universal love. Oh no, I always think of rabbit's feet and prizzies. I completely forgot about the pearl. <laughs> so I just, I just shot myself in the foot, didn't I? <laughs> Neutral towards the hot pepper and absolutely hates dandelions. Kids need gifts too. Let's pick out some for Jazz. Jazz. Boy. Um, this one. I know the loved gift. Um, the neutral gift. I'm trying to remember when she opens her mouth and is like, ah, this is a stupid gift. <laughs> I'm gonna say that she hates that. That might be a universal dislike. Um, we'll do that. And let's go neutral gift of... Um, no, that's a food item. Food items are usually 
usually liked, except for specific ones. I'm trying to remember because... No, I'm thinking of Marnie. That's why. Okay. That is the loved gift. Neutral. Sure. Let's try this. <laughs> the loved gift is plum pudding. Yes. Neutral towards coral. The coral! Oh, that was the one I was debating about. And she absolutely hates juice. Yeah. I, I knew the plum pudding. <laughs> that one I knew. Okay, well, we're, we're, we're not completely lost here. Okay. Probably doesn't even want a gift, but let's look at Sebastian's. Sebastian? Oh, goodness. My Twitch wife won't be happy with me if I get this wrong. Okay. No pressure. I'm sorry. I know there won't be frozen tears in that box. I know he likes frozen tears. Okay. A lot of purple stuff. Oh, no. Of course, Sashimi's not going to be on here. Brooke, I am so sorry. Okay, hold on. Uh... He like he loves like a, a mineral, and none of these look like the mineral that I'm thinking of. I don't know. What, what would a gamer like? You know? You know what? I'm gonna love this because I said so. <laughs> All right, let's let's stick with the, the dish meta. That's what I'm gonna call it. We're we're in a dish meta <laughs> right now. Well, there's only oh ooh, maki roll. No, he likes sashimi. There's only one fish here. Let's go with that. You know what? Screw it. You're getting maki roll. He does love, he does love sashimi. Sebastian loves pumpkin soup. No! That's not fair. Is neutral towards fruit like rhubarb and hates the farmer's lunch. Let's get some gifts for Linus. Linus, alrighty. Linus, oh, um, no coconuts here, of course. Boy, oh boy. Ooh, maybe a yam? Um, Linus loves the yams. You can give him a golden yam on his birthday to get the sashimi recipe. I know. I know, I know, I know that this egg is not a neutral gift. I'm gonna grab it, because what else would it be? He's probably neutral, not towards the fish. I feel like he probably hates a gold bar. Just knowing Linus. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Um, and then I think he might be neutral. Let's go with this one. This is like a an unknown one. It's not right, but it's there. That's not right. It's also there. Linus, of course, loves yams. We use that one for the Sebastian marriage speedrun. Is neutral towards the catfish, and with a sneaky universal hate, hates the carp. Okay, let's sort some gifts for Bernie. Dang it, I was looking for a diamond. <laughs> Oh, that's what she like. I don't know. I know a good bit about Marnie. No diamonds, of course. Emirates? That's gotta be a throw out. That's gotta be it. There's no pink cake. No diamonds. Is there pumpkin pie? No. Ah, uh, oh wait. Ah, uh, I don't know. Oh, okay. Okay, okay. I see, I see. I see your trickery. I'm crying inside. I'm crying. I'm crying. Oh, man. I'm gonna say... Meh, on truffle oil. What does she hate? What would she hate? What would she hate? She hates, like, fish, maybe? I'm gonna say, oh, a rhubarb pie. Actually, you know what? Money would be about a rhubarb pie. And I'm gonna say she absolutely hates... I'm gonna say fish. I don't see Marnie as a fish, fish kind of person, you know what I mean? I'm, I don't feel good about this one. I'm a good elf. Why do I need to know what they hate? Marnie loves the farmer's lunch, is neutral towards wheat, and even though she gives it to you all the time, she hates hay. Alright, this portion of your training is complete. You're all one step closer to becoming fully fledged elves. I'm not so sure if I should be proud of so many people knowing the villagers most hated gifts, but great work anyways. Enjoy your hot cocoa and candy canes made by me. Adorable. Well, this is awesome. I am now full with cocoa and candy canes and bravo on this whole setup. It's beautiful, I love it, and it's cozy. Oh well, man, this whole cook rides me. Feel good after that. I had a boss, this was so much fun. This was such a cool idea, I loved it. Wow, with marshmallows and everything, I love it. Oh my goodness, cute. <laughs> Aw, thank you for the hot cocoa. And a candy cane, oh my goodness, thank you so much. I love candy canes. 
Oh, this hot cocoa is delicious. Oh my goodness, I'm so fast! Oh. <laughs> I could cry. Chug. I love it. Thank you. I love Christmas, the spirit of Christmas. Oh my gosh, thank you so much for having me though. That was so fun. I enjoyed being a little elf. <laughs> I couldn't think of a better way to celebrate and help out Toys for Tots, so thanks again. And to you viewers, this is a fundraising video. There's a link below if you'd like to contribute and more information in the description. And apart from having a fun time taking these gifting lessons to support a great cause, all the helper elves today will be leaving with their own special gift, which is a homemade coupon book. There are five coupons each elf can redeem at any point in time over the next year made by me. No, you can't trade these in for cash, but they do have their own special value. The coupons I've made for you are good for one collab with almost no questions asked, a custom requested emote made by me, a shameless sponsor shout out, which includes a sponsored Sunday live stream where I will take three ad breaks, talk about how great you are, whether I believe it or not, and any video of your choosing will be promoted every 30 minutes in the chat. Redeem this one and I will like and comment on every public YouTube video you've ever posted ever. And when you redeem doing it for the algo, I'll keep your videos on a repeating playlist for one month. I'm Wickedy, thank you so much for celebrating and helping fundraise for Toys for Tots with me, and I will see y'all next time. Bye! Oh, don't judge me. I asked for a leaf blower because oh. I've, I, I've just been drowning in leaves for the longest time. Uh, I have always been really into Pokemon, so I'm hoping that somebody gets me some Pokemon cards this Christmas. Oh, ooh, that sounds fun. Wait, can I, can I run around real quick? Yeah, go for it. Here, ah. uh, you, you can come um, if you want. Ooh, you can look yeah, at yeah, the yeah. Santa's chair. This is adorable. Okay. I'm nervous. Anxiety. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'm doing. <laughs> That's kind of how I feel. Like all of my end game setups have a full coop of rabbits. 100%. And I just give rabbits feet. Because I don't have time for that. <laughs> I don't. <laughs> just go ahead and grab those things and throw them in the purple box. It's our teamwork. We're making the dream work. Yay. I'm really proud of that one point you got. You're doing really good. You're patronizing me. <laughs> Maybe a little, but also like I'm trying to encourage you to. Yeah, I feel like Santa would be so mad if uh, it was just me helping. Everybody oh would just gosh. get all of the wrong gifts. You would be so fired. I don't know how to tell you this. <laughs> Wicked, I'm sweating over here. <laughs> I need like a headband or something. <laughs> that was a bad news. Um, I, I like going with the loved gift first. I feel like, yeah, yeah it's good. Okay, so the most loved gift is actually pumpkin soup. No! Not pumpkin pie. <laughs> I know. Because he's basic. Fair. Vincent. No! Oh wait, no, wrong one, wrong one, wrong one. <laughs> oh my gosh! It's so horrible! Oh my uh, goodness. This is perfect. Ooh. I I hope I've been nice. <laughs> if I've been naughty, oh no. We should get into like hate gift speedruns. <laughs> Maybe. I'll have to do reverse marriage speedruns. You like the the place? Do you want to go sit on Santa's chair? I do. Okay. I do. There you go. <gasps> oh my goodness. I love how you have all of the like the little fairies around. I oh, did you see the piggy part. in the window? We got a piggy in the no. window too. <gasps> oh my goodness. So <laughs> you and the snowman on the other side too. No, don't eat it. No, don't eat the sandfish. There we go. <laughs> No, don't eat it. Uh-oh. Okay, there we go. Oh my god, this is so cute. Thanks, I made and it. Ow. Oh, stop it. Oh, and the boat. And the head. Oh my it's god, look at you. Stop it. <laughs> stop it. I can't handle this right now. <laughs> this is too good. Oh my god, I love it. Where can he stop it? Stop it. I love it. <gasps> oh my god, it's the pig. <laughs> oh, two little snowmen. Yeah, it's like some people have like 10 and then like Alex has like two. <laughs> but then there's Pierre who's like, I uh, yeah. only love calamari. That's it. He's like, I'm a squid guy. I'm a fish dish guy. <laughs>
<laughs> I'll give you the bad news first. I just say, <laughs> er, er, er. Oh my god. <laughs> it's all of it. It's all bad news. <laughs> You know that meme where the woman's staring into nothing and it's just like a whole lot of math equations going past her face? <laughs> yeah. That's me well, right now. <laughs> I just wanted to say I appreciate you building me up before you strike me down. It's, you know, it helped. It really I helped. I mean, I do my best. <laughs> I really appreciate it. Oh my gosh. Okay, wait, I'm taking a screenshot of this. Please do. <laughs> oh, here, let's do it on three. One. Oh, wait, I'm too okay. far ahead of you. Hold on. I won't move. We need, we need to be even for and three. Oh. oh. <laughs> Was it on three or three? Go. Oh. <laughs> That's close enough. It's fine. Okay. So in this box, you'll you'll see my stuff. You can try and guess based on what's in the box. What's my loved, liked, or loved, neutral, and hated. It better not be a baguette. <laughs> <laughs> like I said, it's not you. It's me. <laughs> um, <laughs> You're not breaking up with me, are you? <laughs> are you trying to go explore? I'm being rogue. <laughs> Elf is rogue. I want to know what's in there. <laughs> I'll know if you unwrap the presents and then wrap them back up again. I'll know. Okay. Oh, goodness. Okay. It's okay. I won't tell Brooke. Okay, good. <laughs> it's fine. Uh. This is so cute. Oh, God. The windows are so cute and there's a little traveling cart pig and there's cookies and milk and there's the fairy and this is so cute. You can go sit on Santa's chair too if you want. Oh my gosh, I am Santa now. <laughs> uh, I am the Santa now. This is just beautiful. I'm kind of mesmerized right now. I love it. <laughs> oh, what does that say for you? You just say that you didn't like her. I, I hate her. <laughs> yeah, I gotta write that down. I gotta take notes. Start giving those to her. Okay, our next person is... is... <laughs> That's my sad drum roll. And she's like, she's a book on the shelf in the library and you checked it out. And I brought it to Gunther and I said, hey, I want to I wanna check this out. <laughs> this is how we pay our elves here is with um, cocoa and candy canes. I would take that in real life. 